on. Go on. Square, square. Oh! oh come on, come on. That's the hand with That's the hand with
The one opportunities come from, I know Chris Bannon said it wasn't a back pass and that they've had the back pass and they've took it. But you know, again, we're, we're looking at a game and how many opportunities are we going to have in a game and, and we're not going to take them and, and they're very good opportunities. And the one opportunity they do have, they take, you know, and I think that, that, that's football and the frustrating thing is for us is that we were, what, maybe favourites at the start of the season and I don't know if it's a little bit got on top of us, I don't know, but I've just said there, you need to have people who are willing to run through a brick wall for you. And you need to have people that, yeah, when things aren't going well, they're going to hide the tackles in, they're going to, they're, they're going to make the runs, they're going to, they're going to, and even if they don't get the ball, they're going to keep working and working hard and working hard. And I just thought, start the second half, we started off really well, uh, passed the ball around really well, started doing the things that we could do. Matty Tumpley, man the match we made, centre half, really, really good game. Um, but, it's it's just the basics again of not putting the ball in the back of the net, you know. And you, 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 the positive is we're creating. The negative is that we're just not taking chances. And from the start of the season, from the thought of the game, next winning game, uh, when we were taking chances, we aren't finishing teams off. And the second goal was massive for us. And well, we didn't get it, you know. We've had a couple of one-on-ones in the first half, again, and the chances at the end there, and you think, wow, it's not going to be our night here. And again, it wasn't. Again, it wasn't. Like the first half, it was, was a bit of a scrappy yeah. affair, but like there were some very clear-cut chances. Yeah. Did we think before that first goal came that it might be one of those nights, or were you always confident? That it no, because I, because I think I, I've, I've, I've always, we've always got confidence in the team that we put out, me and Andy, and we actually thought the formation, how we we're, were going to play, was going to work for us and work for us really well. And I think you know, Ben was doing a, a great job here, the lads here, and to get to get a team together on what they've got to, to work with and. We knew what, what they wouldn't be short of is a bit of desire and a bit of heart and a bit of, I'm going to run around this pitch to, to I can't run anymore. And you know what it is? When, it, when at the end of the day, we didn't match that. And, and that is a disappointing thing for me. Um, and do you think going forward as well, Mick, do you think it might be a case because you have been touted as one of the favourites, if not me, that game, yeah. teams might raise the game a little bit? Yeah, like yeah. To yeah well, the teams are, you know. We, we, we've, got, we've, got a, we've got a good budget in this league. You know, and uh, our, our chairman's given us that. Then you know, and you know, you've got lads in here who have come along, and you need people to, to perform. And I, and people aren't performing. And if people aren't performing, you've got to look at things. You've got to look at options. You've got to look at. Do you, do you look at players from outside and bring other new players in, and and have a look at things because, you know, we we'll, we have just went off the boil massively. And, you know, and eight points in the, in the, in the out of 18 is, is in championship form and, you, and there's so many teams who are winning games and when, now the pressure is definitely on us against Bedlam which which by the way as I've said in there your people like Ian Herons and that will have their lives up for that one and as if you do need it for a derby game but oh god I'm looking forward to that one on, yeah. on, on Monday but just how important at the stage of the season is you know we, want, we needed six points off this we needed really to win today and to win Monday. And even at this early stage, what you don't want to do is be playing catcher. We did it last season. We had a really bad start last year. And then we went 16 games unbeaten, which dragged us right in it. But when you're booked 12, 13, 14 points behind, if those teams keep winning, even though they might drop that one point or one defeat, if you lose a point, it's back up again. And, and, that, and, and, that, and, that's, and, and, and that's how... But I think this league will be wide open. And I think there's about 10 to 15 teams with, with, an opportunity, with the opportunity of going up. You know, and um, we just, we thought, and uh, we still think that we've improved this squad in the, in the summer, and we just need people now just to look at it and go right, roll the sleeves up, put a shift in for us, and 
we'll be we'll, we'll be okay. We, we're just we're in a slump, and and and, and uh, as I said before off, off off camera, this is the first time in, in nine years I've been here. We've done this four games, so it's a whole new feeling for me, and uh, it's I'm deflated. I am really deflated. Are you confident that you can pull it around on Monday? Do you think you can get back to winning? It's a derby game. Uh, you know we've beaten twice five 0 last year. Uh, but they've, they've, made, they've made some good signings, made signings with a lot of heart, with a lot of ability as well. And, you know, if we, we're not at the races, we'll get beat Monday. And, uh, and lads need to go away and they need to, need, to, need to think about what they want in life. You know, I'm, I've no doubt we'll have to answer to the chairman at some point in the next couple of days and, 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 and talk to him and, uh, about what, what exactly is going wrong. Yeah, and you know what it is, we've got a great management staff, a great, a great support staff, you know, rough and making that there with the physio side. Barry can't give us any more. And, 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 and I'm big enough to, to, I've got to take the blame here and, and, and look at it and say if the players aren't performing, I've got to be the one that's got to stand here and say, hey, you know, I'll, I'll take the pats on the back and I'll, I'll, take the, I'll, I'll, I'll take the things when things aren't right and things aren't right at the minute. And you know, that's a good dressing room, we've got good people, good quality. And it just, it, it'll turn, but we need to turn sooner rather than later.